Good morning and welcome to my home vlog. I have never filmed a video like this before, but I thought it would be kind of fun to show you guys some of the things I do around the house on like a day-to-day -day basis and <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> some errands that I have to run, things I have to take care of. So I thought I'd bring my camera out and film everything. My mom is coming over to help me figure out where to hang these prints. I got a bunch of these in Amsterdam and they're so sick. Some of these are Basquiat. This one is Keith Haring, but I have like eight of these and just a lot of wall space. So we're gonna figure out where to hang those and do some light wood frames around them to kind of help keep the theme of the house going. And then I'm also remodeling my deck finally outside. I have like nothing out there right now and it looks pretty ugly to be honest. So I'm thinking of doing this gray it looks like wood, it's not, just so it's more weatherproof. But I think I'm gonna do that, order some outdoor furniture, which I'm so excited about. I love designing spaces and just making areas really cozy. And so I'm really excited for that. I'll probably do another video on how I decide to put that all together. I had a really good meeting yesterday with, I don't know what I guess I call him. I have a lot of custom wood pieces in my house. For example, this I had custom made and some of my cabinets and uh, wood slats all around my house. And so my wood guy came over yesterday and we're coming up with a really cool concept for this wall in my house, which I'm gonna show you guys. And some other, oh yeah, we're remodeling the stairs. So see this behind me is my stair case and it just looks really dated. We remodeled my house completely and just didn't get a chance to do this yet. So we're thinking of doing the stairwell all glass and just taking this off it's like a little bit 60s vibes right now and just doesn't really match the rest of the house so i'm so excited to do that that'll probably take a bit of time but i wanted to update you guys on that and then show you guys what i'm doing with this big white wall this is this space right here and so i ended up buying this and realizing that even if i put art above it it's just such a big wall and so i feel like it's not it's just not cozy, you know? So I'm thinking of doing a big bookcase there that covers the whole wall, built-in bookshelves, that's what it's called. And then we're gonna put some accent lighting in there and then maybe a rug over here and just, I don't know, making it more cozy and then the light wood to tie it all. And oh yeah, we're also doing some shelving. Actually a bar, let me turn the light on, before and we took this out um because we don't drink so i have storage under here and but this is like kind of boring right now so i want to do some shelves on this side and this side and then maybe some art back here to make it a little bit more exciting they put a tootsie roll in here these are from Giant Vintage. Stop. Are they weird? I feel like they're, I don't know. I love like glasses that look like this. I've been seeing them all over Instagram and I feel like they're cool. I'm so excited about. I have never ordered anything from Jerf, Jerf Avenue. I hope I'm saying that right. But I see this dress and bathrobe all over Instagram, this print. And so the bathrobe is sold out, so I got the dress. It's so cute. I think it's also a nightgown. It's so, I'm obsessed with the, like the fruit pattern. Friend Natalie sent me these pants, which I'm so excited about. The first night I met her, this is her clothing brand called Elliday. And the first night I met her, she was wearing these pants and I was like, I don't know, I feel like it's so hard to find cool white pants that are just like soft and they're like kind of look like linen pants, but they're not. So, and they're kind of baggy. They're so sick. Thank you, Natalie. And she also sent me this top with like a little, I'm obsessed with this. And guys, there's more in here. This is like Christmas. She sent me, are these the pants in black? Oh no, these are different. So cool. Love these. Thank you, Natalie. Whoa, wait, this is really sick. This is so cute. It's like a halter top that ties in the back. 
This is actually very unique. I've never seen anything like this before. This is adorable. Yes, my pump. What's happening today? How are you? I'm good. Where are we going to dinner tonight? I'm already starving. I haven't made, I'm, I ask you, I, any place, as I said. It, um, but I'm, uh, I've only had a bowl of, of granola f for breakfast, and that's it. I, but I would love to, I would love to see you. I'd love to give you a hug. It's just like, yeah, I don't care. We can just even go for a walk, anything. doing some work on my computer. I am currently in the middle of find, looking for a manager for acting. So I've been working on trying to memorize the script to send to her, which is actually a script from Cruel Intentions. I have to film a self-tape. And it's honestly been very nerve-wracking filming self-tapes. I feel like I get so nervous, but it's just part of the process and necessary for them to see your acting and see if you guys are a good fit. So I understand why I have to do it, but I'm like, uh. And I'm also ordering some clothes for some reels I'm gonna shoot next week and just getting back on some emails that I haven't responded to yet. We are going to get sushi. Hello f fans and friends and enemies. Listen to a little Post Malone here. day in LA I postmated <laughs> I woke up craving whipped cream which is so weird and random I think it's like about to be that time of the month so I postmated a coffee with whipped cream on it which I've never even had before we are on our way to the grocery store I decided I want to make soup for dinner I'm craving something kind of cozy because it's about to be fall and I found this recipe on Pinterest that looks really good. And I also make one, <laughs> I make the best banana bread. And so, and I have some ripe bananas. I just need some more ingredients. I need to get sour cream and I think more flour. So I'm gonna make that so we can start dinner. I just wanted to say how happy I am to be back on YouTube. I feel like it's my smallest platform and it's kind of my favorite right now. I feel like a lot more connected with you guys than other platforms and it's something that like I don't really I'm having a hard time with I feel like it's feeling connected to my fans fans oh my god I hate that word fans <laughs> follow people who follow me and I think it's because I don't know it's like on Instagram I feel like it can be a bit shallow and so I'm very excited to start YouTubing showing you guys like my actual life and like things that I do I feel like it's kind of fun so yeah <laughs> 